What's going on, guys? Sam here. So, uh, we're at the Lenexa Regionals in Kansas. I uh, got top 32 for Gretchen's profile. This for you guys. A lot of you guys have been asking about the Barnyard uh, profile, and I've not uploaded it, really, uploaded it in like a year. So, here we go. So, we got a triple dog, obviously, triple bear, and triple wings. And that is actually it for all the fluffles. It's really kind of all you need for the Barnyard build, anyway. Uh, they're, they're really just your draw, your draw engine, and then you're just your kind of just help you push for game and stuff. So, uh, yeah. And then, uh, they're just, yeah, pretty much just combos just to get into your uh, front first just to pretty much clear your opponent's board. Uh, just two and one. Uh, three is kind of really clogging in this build because, like, you don't really need it. And you're only playing one Fry for Fusion in this build, too. So, uh, one engine savers. And then onto the Shadals, we just play two Shadal Beasts, one Hog, and then one Dragon. Um, I thought about siding the second Dragon for just for extra macro stuff, but uh, one Hog's good because you never really want to see it unless you're just fusing from deck for checking Hog, add the Beast to your hand, and then negate and draw, so it's really good. Uh, four's good. You never really see them unless you need them, and then if you do have them in your hand, you uh, run double alert in this deck, so. Uh, two Mexi, obviously. And then three King of the Swamp, which broke his card in the deck, and just pitch it from hand in the grave, search Poly, and then Miracle Fuse with it in the grave. It's crazy. <laughs> and then one glow bulb. Glow bulb and dog is Nat Beast and it's just nuts. It's crazy. Um, going into spells. We run a uh, triple toy vendor. We run a uh, double or darkness. This was at three, but I bumped it down to two just because uh, I bumped the Shadals down from like five or six down to four. And uh, to put in, make room for some other stuff that I've had recently. Uh, double Insta Fusion, you want to see it, but you don't. You only want to see it really once per game. Um, Insta Fusion is Winda, Sheep, and Norton all in once. So really just whatever you need. It's really good. Triple Shadal Fusion. Uh, I'll, get, I'll get in with the combo here in that, with that here in a minute. Uh, triple Poly. Double Twin Twister. I was playing this at three, but I decided the third instead. Uh, one Fry Fusion because you don't really, you only need to resolve this one time and you don't want to open it because you have nothing in your grave, especially with just running nine fluffles and three edge jumps. And then double this. This was MVP all day against ABC. I played like four ABC and I beat them all except for one. So, uh, and then one Foolish because you want to send any of your shells, uh, drag in the pop back row, send wings, and then after you've already done your bear, get your draw combos off. It's 41 main deck. Uh, can cut out one card, two attached. So uh, going into the extra, uh, one saber tooth because you only really need to resolve one. One wolf was just because space. Uh, double tiger and double sheep, and this is all we play for the frappers. And going into these, we play uh, double window, uh, double check. Um, one Norton, Utopia, one Nat Beast, and this is freaking MVP all day long, guys. Like, this helps, this card helps you just unbreak your hands. Like, if you just have two monsters that are just dark in your hand, and you just want to have something out there that's going to mess everybody up. Like, what it does is um, you copy and paste your opponent's attack, and you add it to yours. And then you copy and paste their effect, and you add it to you. So, like, somebody had Buster Dragon out there, and they couldn't tap out because their field was full. So, like, I, t I gained his attack, so I was, like, 58. And then I, like, gained his effect, and I was, like, this card banishes Buster Dragon. And Buster Dragon is crazy. So, yep. And uh, Triple Magical Spring played against Melfos. Uh, had love this card for, like, two years. It's awesome. Uh, they can't pop their scales. They can't do anything. So, uh, yeah. One Twin Twister. Play this against the Teller Knights. I played one today. You just attack in there to Neb and steal it, and then it attaches it, and then they can't really do anything after that. Uh, side this against Blue Eyes, blow up the Dark Matter, and uh, burn them for 4k. Side this against Metal Foes. Uh, really, what it does is it's a, a ring of destruction for every single card on their side of the field, and they just burn for everything except for Fusion Monsters. And destroys them all. Double Roll Decree, two uh, Free Wheelie, and then Double Dark Hole. And that is it for the deck profile. I'm going to show you guys a combo real quick. Really, what I want to try to do with this deck is consistently enough, you only have one normal summon in the whole entire deck. And that's Dog. You want to resolve shit all fusion. And what you want to do is you want to either send like hog or beast or something else to the grave, uh, and plus, and then along with the global, <coughs> the dog you're gonna search for your other part of your draw combo. So you're pretty much gonna get th three cards off of that. And then once you summon Shek and Aga out with that, you get this to the field, and then you go Nat Beast, and this is pretty much a two card combo that lets you get Shek and Aga and Nat Beast out on the field. And it's pretty hard to get around that first turn anyway. So and then all your other cards like Insta Fusion, all the other polys or whatever you just summon like tiger window whatever else just pop them and stall them so it's pretty crazy so that is it for the deck profile guys uh, like subscribe and all the good stuff see you later